Welcome to today's presentation. Today we are going to look at series and sequences and the question we have here reads the first term of an arithmetic sequence is negative 7 and the common difference is 3. Then part A list the first six terms of the sequence and then finally part B determine the sum of the first 50 terms of the sequence. So straight to the first part we have to list the first six terms of the sequence and the sequence is an arithmetic sequence so we need to understand that the nth term of an arithmetic sequence is given as the first term plus n minus 1 times the common difference where n represents the number of terms so if n is 1 that is the first term then we have a plus 1 minus 1 is 0 times d, so this becomes 0. So we'll have a for the first term. And we are already told that that is negative 7. Now if n is 2, that is the second term, we'll have a plus 2 minus 1, that is 1, so 1d. That becomes a plus d, and that is simply negative 7 plus the common difference which is 3 so that is negative 4 next we move to the third term In the third term n is 3 so we'll have a plus 3 minus 1 that is 2 so we have 2d and that is negative 7 plus 2 times 3 that is 6 so that gives us negative 1 the fourth term is the first term plus 4 minus 1 that is 3 d and then a is negative 7 plus 3 times d that is 3 times 3 9 we have that as 2 next we look at the fifth term in the fifth term we'll have a plus 5 minus 1 that is 4 so 4 d and that is negative 7 for a and then 4 times 3 that is 12 so plus 12 that should give us 5 then finally the sixth term is a plus 6 minus 1 that is 5 so 5d and that is negative 7 for a and then plus 5 times d that is 5 times 3 15 that gives us 8 so listing the terms will begin with the first one negative 7 then negative 4 negative 1 2 5 and finally 8 now to the next part we are asked to determine the sum of the first 50 terms of the sequence so for an AP the sum of the first n terms is given as n over 2 into twice the first term plus n minus 1 d so for this case we are told the first 50 terms so that means n is 50 so we have 50 over 2 into twice the first term and the first term in the sequence you can see is negative 7 so 2 times negative 7 that should be negative 14 and then we'll have to add that to 50 minus 1 because n is 50. 50 minus 1 that is 49. And then 49 multiplied by d and d we already have as 3. So multiplying by 3 we'll have this as 25. Times so 49 times 3 minus 14 that gives us 133 and then when we multiply 25 by 133 this should give us 3325 and that is the sum of the first 50 terms of the sequence so that is it for this question thank you for watching see you next time